तो हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू येट अनदर स्मॉल सेगमेंट ऑन द थर्ड मैन क्रिकेट शो तो आज हम फिर से लेकर आए काफी यूनिक एंड वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक टू डिस्कस अबाउट स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी तो माना कि स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी के बारे में अभी करंटली न्यूज में काफी बवाल मैच रहा है जैसे हम कहते हैं इन सिंपल हिंदी टर्म्स तो इट इज द बेस्ट टाइम टू टॉक अबाउट व्हाट इज स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी इंडियन क्रिकेट को कैसे इंपैक्ट किया वर्ल्ड क्रिकेट को कैसे इंपैक्ट किया एंड व्हाट इज द फ्यूचर ऑफ इट तो हमारे साथ जुड़े हुए ओंकार आचार्य यहाँ पे नन अदर देन द बिग फैन ऑफ मुंबई इंडियंस एंड इंडियन क्रिकेट टीम तो ओंकार वेलकम टू द शो तो सबसे पहले हमारे ऑडियंस को बता देते हैं एग्जैक्टली व्हाट स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी मींस इन वर्ल्ड क्रिकेट तो आप यस बिल्कुल स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी इज ऑल अबाउट डिफरेंट कैप्टन फॉर ईच फॉर्मेट लाइक वॉट हैपन्स इज द ईच एसोसिएशन दैट इज द बोर्ड फॉर बोर्ड फॉर द कंट्री स्पेशली हैंडलिंग क्रिकेट वॉट दे डू इज दे अपॉइंट टू कैप्टन वन फॉर द व्हाइट बॉल क्रिकेट दैट इज द लिमिटेड ओवर्स फॉर्मेट विच इंक्लूड दी ओडियाज एंड दी ट्वेंटी आईज and uh, one they appoint for the red ball format that is a test cricket where one captain t- uh, completely takes over the test uh, format and the other captain completely takes over the odi and the t20 format so this has been done in australia like uh, we have a great great example right in the current uh, uh, situation as well pat cummings as the test captain and uh, aaron finch uh, leading them in the odis and the t20 since a long time so australia have been doing it uh, since a long time we had seen three captains in three formats as well uh i guess in uh, test it was steve smith uh, in odis it was george bailey and in t20 as again it was aaron finch since 2014 2013 and 2014 so you can see how the cricket australia has been di- uh, usually using the dimensions of different captains in different formats एग्जैक्टली जैसे ओमकार ने यहाँ पे कहा कि हमने तो बस अब दो कैप्टन के बारे में सुने व्हाइट बॉल एंड रेड बॉल कैप्टन बट तीन कैप्टन इन थ्री डिफरेंट फॉर्मेट्स वाज अ वेरी रेयर ओकेजन एंड ऑस्ट्रेलिया एज ऑलवेज दे आर द इनोवेटर्स वो ही yeah. सबसे पहले चेंज लाते हैं तो उन्होंने किया था मुझे याद है दो हजार की बात है दिस वॉज ड्यूरिंग द वर्ल्ड कप एंड अराउंड दैट वर्ल्ड कप पीरियड ही था तो काफी यूनिक अप्रोच था वो तो स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी के बारे में जैसे ओमकार ने यहाँ पे मैंशन किया इट्स अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग कंसेप्ट एंड करंटली बिकॉज ऑफ द Workload that uh, we can see in the scheduling. मतलब एक 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 दो दो महीने में you see the teams touring twice. Two दो बार वो tour करते हैं. अभी recently you you will see that uh, just test match खत्म होने के एक दो दिन बाद you see them playing a T20 series. फिर ODI series. फिर थोड़े दिन के gap के बाद they'll be going to a West Indies. So there is no break. So that is why you really need two different mindset and approach in world cricket. And that is why split captaincy का ये जो term आया since uh, the लेटर पार्ट ऑफ टू थाउजेंड टेन तभी आया था उसके पहले यू नॉर्मली सो वन कैप्टन लीडिंग ऑल द फॉर्मेट एम एस धोनी वॉज देर इवन विराट कोहली आफ्टर टेकिंग ओवर द कैप्टनसी लाइक इन टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन सेवनटीन सेवनटीन या एम एस धोनी रिजाइंड एज अ कैप्टन उसके बाद विराट कोहली वॉज ऑल्सो द वन फॉर्म वन कैप्टन ओनली फॉर ऑल द फॉर्मेट्स तो ओमकार इंडियन की क्रिकेट टीम के बारे में बात करते हैं वी स्पोक अबाउट एम एस धोनी वी स्पोक अबाउट विराट कोहली तो पास्ट के बारे में हो गई बातें अब आते हैं करंट में तो रिसेंटली इन जनवरी 2022 साल का पहला झटका लगा विराट कोहली मतलब टेस्ट कैप्टन से ही अनाउंस हिज रेजिग्नेशन व्हिच वाज अ बिग शॉक ही ट्वेंट इज यस यू यू एक्सपेक्टेड हिम टू डू दैट रोहित शर्मा वाज गोना कम इन एंड गेट इट ओडीआई इज आल्सो फेयर इनफ फ्यूचर प्लानिंग के बारे में बट टेस्ट कैप्टनसी छोड़ना वाज अ बिग शॉकर एंड इंडियन क्रिकेट टीम बीसीसीआई ने हमें वो शॉकर दिया था तो रोहित शर्मा इन जनवरी 2022 बिकेम द ऑल फॉर्मेट कैप्टन फॉर टीम इंडिया तो उसके बारे में बात करते हैं ओंकार आचार्य व्हाट डू यू थिंक इट एक्चुअली मेंट फॉर इंडियन क्रिकेट टीम गोइंग फॉरवर्ड व्हेन रोहित शर्मा वाज अनाउंस एज द वन कैप्टन फॉर्मेट वेल संचित टॉकिंग अबाउट द कैप्टनसी फर्स्ट लाइक वी वर वेरी मच सिमिलर की मतलब हां विराट कोहली ने खुद ही बोला था कि मैं टी20 कैप्टनसी छोडूंगा और फिर बाद में ओडिया में रोहित शर्मा का अपॉइंट किया गया था और सी बी का विजन यही था कि वी डोंट वांट टू सेपरेट कैप्टन फॉर टू वाइट बॉल फॉर्मेट्स लाइक मैं जैसे मैंने कहा था कि इन ऑस्ट्रेलिया दे हैड सेपरेट कैप्टन फॉर टी ट्वेंटी आईज एंड ओडिया आईज बट इन इंडिया वी हैवेंट सीन वेन एम एस वॉज नॉट देर इन टेस्ट वेन यू हैड रिटायर्ड विराट कोहली वॉज कंट्रोलिंग द टेस्ट एंड एम एस वॉज कंट्रोलिंग द वाइट बॉल सो वी कैन सी दैट वी हैड अपॉइंटेड टू कैप्टन सो डेफिनेटली यहाँ पे भी वही विजन था कि टू इफ ही इज बिन अपॉइंटेड एज द टी ट्वेंटी आई कैप्टन so definitely he will also continue as the odi captain as well because we have a three uh, events back to back this year is the t20 world cup in australia next year we are going to host the mega 50 over world cup 
the or uh, i guess the one of, one of the most thrilling formats uh, odi which uh, has everything you have to play sense uh, stance sensibly you have to attack as well and in 24 we have uh, the uh, t20 world cup again after a gap of two years that will be played in us especially matlab jaise ye saal fifa qatar mein ho raha hai waise hum log us jaane wale 24 mein so uh, talking about the captaincy yahi vision tha bci ka but uh, Uh, one man uh, uh, the, the way we are recording right now is his birthday so happy, happy birthday ms dhoni a captain cool he said that uh, split captaincy doesn't work in india uh, though uh, he was retired uh, from the test format and he was uh, continuing the white ball uh, but he had uh, stated the statement that captaincy doesn't work in india because of various reasons uh, the, if, if you see uh, the australian format or even the english conditions you might see uh, the players who are playing test cricket are majority in the test uh, format and the setup only they don't uh, mix with the uh, t20 format or sometimes even in the odi like for example if uh, lem Le- lingshun is in the t20 and the odi format he won't be in the uh, red ball format and joe root has been completely uh, they, uh, almost uh, he has uh, retired from uh, t20 is like he no, though he has not of- officially announced it but we can say that he is not playing t20is he's just playing odi format and uh, the main test format so uh, well ms what ha- he had said that and i guess uh, to avoid the chaos or maybe sometimes to uh, uh, bring a one captain all the format because we see that uh, in india many of our players play all the format simultaneously like it's uh, kl rahul rishabh pant uh, jasprit bumrah shreya sayyar ravindra jadeja uh, even uh, shami playing the odis and t20s we have uh, siraj then many more coming upcoming players like prasid krishna playing some of the other even akshar patel was been uh, drafted into the white ball so definitely to uh, to uh, avoid uh, the uh, too many cooks spoil the food uh, kind of thing the pcc had decided to go uh, with rohit sharma as a full time uh, captain but uh, the way it was handled and what we witnessed and what we saw from the board from the players it was completely uh, another uh, thing uh, uh, out of context of the this approach uh, but yes uh, that was the only reason that too many cooks uh, spoil the food Uh, so BCC had uh, gone with uh, one captain as all three formats. Too many cooks spoil the food. ये जो concept है, I think it is perfectly describing the chaos of split captaincy. तो जितना हमारे दोस्त ओमकार ने यहाँ पे explain किया है, what are the benefits of having a split captain? See, what is the benefit of having just one captain across all the formats? तो जितना मुझे समझा है as a student on this uh, on this panel learning about split captaincy, it is good to have just one captain across all the formats. If your team, if your squad contains majority of all format player, जैसे कि इंडिया, इंडिया में काफी ऐसे players हैं जो all the formats खेलते हैं, and that is why one captain can really work better than having split captains. Because split captaincy अगर आ जाती है, then you have two different mindset, two different ideology, two different tactics, which can get confusing for the same player to actually adapt. मतलब test आया, तो ये करो, और ये आया, तो ये करो. So अगर you have majority of all format players, then it is better to go with one captain. बट अगर सेम बात आती है कि इफ यू हैव फॉर्मेट स्पेशलिस्ट प्लेयर जैसे कि इंग्लैंड ऑस्ट्रेलिया यू सी दैट टेस्ट स्कॉड यू सी दैट व्हाइट बॉल स्कॉड इट इज कम्प्लीटली डिफरेंट इंग्लैंड की व्हाइट बॉल स्कॉड तो मतलब देख के लिए हम लोग ने टेस्ट स्कॉड में दे हैव एंडरसन स्टुअर्ट ब्रॉड ऐसे सब प्लेयर्स है सो टू अवॉइड दैट के ऑस टू कीप अ डिफरेंट माइंड सेट एंड अप्रोच फॉर डिफरेंट फॉर्मेट इट इज बेटर फॉर दोज कंट्रीज टू हैव अ स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी रूट तो आई थिंक दैट इज द बेस्ट वे टू एक्सप्लेन कौन से टीम को करनी चाहिए कौन से टीम को नहीं करनी चाहिए तो अभी हम बात करते हैं फ्यूचर ऑफ स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी इंडियन टीम को ही लेके हम बात करते हैं तो जैसे यहाँ पे हमने हेडलाइन दी है फ्यूचर ऑफ स्प्लिट कैप्टनसी इज इट वायबल तो उनका चलिए इंडियन टीम की तरफ चलते हैं एक दो साल आगे की तरफ हम देखते हैं राइट राइट आफ्टर द टू वर्ल्ड कप इट नो ट्रेनर दैट वी विल पॉसिबली सी द लाइक्स ऑफ रोहित शर्मा मे बी विराट कोहली फॉर दैट मैटर शिखर धवन विल बी प्लेंग द लास्ट मेजर वर्ल्ड कप for team india so uske baad i think we will be going a different approach a new start after 2022 world cup so i just want to throw this question to you omkar and also to those who are watching this video in on youtube so aap bhi bata sakte in the comment section do you think split captaincy should return to india having different captains for different formats after 2023 world cup well uh, sanjit uh, i guess uh, बोला बोला चाहिए एक एक मिनट मिनट वेल संचित आई थिंक इट हैज बीन 
a perfect question put up by you because in future we have seen like uh, in this year as well we saw Hardik, we saw Pant, we saw Bumrah, we saw KL Rahul uh, being the captain uh, for the Indian team and even uh, we saw in the IPL that uh, uh, Shreyas Ayer was the captain and even uh, Shikhar, Shikhar Dhawan had captain, Bhuvneshwar Kumar had also captain uh, Sunrises Hyderabad, Mayank Agarwal Punjab ke captain the, uh, so <coughs> I'm sorry, definitely this is going to be a huge part. But uh, looking at the Indian prospect and uh, if uh, if I have to give an example of uh, one country that is England. So I'll talk about like uh, when uh, we saw that Ben Stokes was appointed as a captain right now after Joe Root stepping down. But if you see that in India, if a player has been appointed as a vice captain, he will be appointed as a vice captain across all the formats. So like we saw uh, the form of Ajinkya Rani was a bit upside down. That's why Rohit Sharma was appointed as the vice captain in the test as well. So we had uh, uh, Virat Kohli as the captain for all the formats till now before uh, the T20 eyes and the ODIs were being played and Rohit Sharma as the vice captain in all the three formats. But in uh, if we take the example of England, it is very difficult because Ben Stokes as the captain uh, of uh, the England test team is not a vice captain as well in the white ball team. There is Josh Butler leading uh, now in the absence of... Uh, uh, Morgan's retirement, uh, but uh, you know that this has been a complete uh, different uh, strategy and thinking by the uh, ECB because they always think uh, of a revolutionization of cricket. We saw this uh, in the test in the test format as well, the way they uh, played against us and even the Black Caps. And also talking about the revolution which they brought, uh, so eliminating main main players like Alistair Cook, Ian Bell, uh, Stuart Broad, Stephen Finn, and even. Uh, uh, James Anderson from the ODI after uh, immediately after the 2015 World Cup was not that easy to handle. Uh, the fans would have uh, definitely uh, made something or the other. The Parmi Army, which we call this uh, big uh, English team fan, they would have also thought of it. Uh, what these uh, what these uh, decisions will uh, see ahead in the future. But we saw that uh, they have been uh, playing really well, and we saw the World Cup irrespective of the how they won it. But at least they have a World Cup in the trophy cabinet. So, talking about India, I don't see a uh, split captaincy because uh, we have all format players because if uh, we have been, we have drafted Shreyas uh, a year, for example, in the ODI and the T20, he has now been drafted in the test as well, test setup as well. We saw uh, Siraj uh, in the uh, test setup first and then uh, uh, now coming back in the white ball format as well. So, a bit of uh, uh, still, uh, I have uh, doubts regarding split captaincy in India, but uh, I would uh, say that uh, Team India and the BCCI especially would definitely go with uh, uh, one uh, format captain because uh, the captain who will be leading in all the three formats, it will be easier. But uh, if you see, uh, there is one benefit, uh, one uh, uh, disadvantage that it, it will be hard to manage the workload of that particular player who is the captain because we uh, we, we have we saw that uh, when uh, Kohli was the captain he was be, uh, being given rested sometimes uh, even the Asia Cup or the Nidhaas Trophy or the uh, small bilateral white ball series where Rohit Sharma had uh, been uh, uh, done the captaincy and even uh, we saw that uh, many a times when MS uh, uh, used to do that uh, Virat Kohli or Suresh Raina were the captains uh, in the absence of MS. So, it's very difficult for Team India and uh, the BC set to uh, use the this approach of the split captaincy in the future as well. Interesting. So, Omkar is saying that one of the captain even after 2023 World Cup. So, audience, mein, if you watch this video, you can also name your possible options for captaincy after 2023 World Cup and say why you feel split captaincy should be implemented or not implemented. We would love to see what you guys have to say. So that's all we had for today's episode. So split captaincy coffee, new trending phenomena in world cricket. So it is definitely going to be there whether India implements it or not. So let's see what happens. And uh, abhi to currently it tha. So hope you all really enjoyed watching this video and heard a lot of new insights regarding this particular topic. We'd also love to see what you guys have to say. So do subscribe to our channel to catch up with more such engaging content. Like this video, share it with your friends and family and do comment what are your views on the topic of split captains. So, till then, this is Sanchit Desai along with Umkar Acharya signing off. Have a wonderful day. Everybody.